Now that you've created a BigCommerce account, let's look at how you can import an existing product catalog to your new store. If you're inside your WordPress dashboard, go to BigCommerce, select Products, and click Manage on BigCommerce. This action is the same as going directly to products from inside your BigCommerce dashboard. If your store still includes the automatically generated sample products, this is a good time to pause, select them all, and use the bulk actions to delete them. Now, click the Import link inside the Products menu. The first step to importing products is to select the CSV file that contains all your product data. If you haven't already generated a proper CSV file, review our documentation for details on what it should include. Next, configure the import options for this CSV. Check this first box if the CSV file was generated within BigCommerce using the bulk edit template. The next option lets you overwrite products if their names match any products in your CSV. With this selected, you can also choose to delete the existing product's images or downloadable files. After this, select whether or not you want BigCommerce to set the product categories from the CSV file. Now, decide if blank values should be ignored. This is a great option to use when overriding existing products because you can include only the data that needs to change inside your CSV file and leave the other fields blank. Next, you can use the default option type input to select which style of option should be displayed on products that omit this field from the CSV. The final three options help describe your CSV file to the importer. Use these to declare if your file includes header labels as well as how the fields are separated. On the next page, you can individually map each field from your CSV file to the appropriate field in BigCommerce. If you use the BigCommerce bulk export template, you shouldn't need to change anything here. If you need help mapping your data, we're here for you. You can contact our support specialist with questions or take advantage of our full catalog transfer services. After you've finished mapping your product data, you can continue and start the import. Once the import is finished, you'll see a status report that includes the number of products that were successfully imported or updated, how many duplicates were skipped, and how many failed to import. Now would be a great time to head back to WordPress and manually trigger a sync on the products page. And with that, congratulations, you're ready to start selling. Check out our other videos and learn how you can make the most of BigCommerce for WordPress.